All right. I'm having a hard time here. I was just, I was just taking pictures. I just um, got, I got my shed up, and I, I'm not shed the garage, portable garage, and and uh, reason being is that uh, the city won't let me uh, build anything within 15 foot, like any storage 15 foot within the house. So, needless to say, uh, portable is portable, and it's not permanent. So, that's my workaround. So anyway, I got a really nice garage. This thing is nice size. I mean, really nice size. Um, it's, uh, I have, I have a lot of kids equipment, a lot of sports equipment. My garage is full. I'm going to put it out here. So nothing wrong with that. Even my bikes are going out here. So I'm um, going to clear it out to where I have more of a work area in my big garage. And then this garage is going to be just for storage. But anyway, it put together really nice. Um, nice thing about this one is, is it has two doors, one on each end that unzip. Um, I didn't remember seeing that. I was just needing one, but two. Uh, so having two, I decided to give a little more room on the other side too. So a little more room on this side so I can get larger things in. And if I just want to pop in, I could go to the nearest, uh, and go in as that as well. Um, unzips beautifully. I mean, absolutely. This is just, this is... <laughs> This is just, this is, it just it just zips i mean these are quality zippers so i'm saying they are really nice uh this mesh is so tiny and it's got this mesh in between and it's uh there's no way mosquitoes can get in that's for sure so that's really nice that's uh that's not cheap stuff so anyway everything velcros down this is layered in even and what i like about this is it allows air to go inside so you're not thin on air when it gets hot uh, there's they thought this was a really really well designed uh, garage I have to say now here's the velcro thing the velcro is tight it doesn't come off um, the same thing for each end is actually velcroed inside this side see so it is really strong velcro <laughs> it is strong anyway I staked it down there and tied them around the bottom so they wouldn't go up as if they would I'm lucky enough that I have an eight-foot fence house on the other side. There's no way for wind to pop in and, and take off with the garage. So um, it has some really steep peaks. I wasn't anticipating being so high up, but at this point, really don't care. <laughs> anyway, my long-term thought is I'm going to build a floor in the bottom of these. You know, so there we go. Mm. Oh, I lost my glasses. Anyway, um, I just wanted to show how I love these things. These little things here that tie these down, they go throughout the whole thing. And then it's Velcro, the same strong Velcro stuff ties around each bar. There's two on each side and, and everything snaps in. This thing, this was a little bit longer. This one took me about an hour to put up. It took me about an hour, only because reading the instructions, uh, you have to pull things just right to get everything evened out, especially up here at the top. Um, but uh, anyway, I love I love how they have these things on here. And what I'm going to do is I'm just going to build a raised platform in here, and. Uh, and that's going to be almost like a real solid garage so that's my plan as it is now it's going to be used as is see how nice that zipper is i'm really impressed with zippers and that's one of them but i love the how it's layered wind can't get in i have a strong pretty strong winds today and this thing is barely moving so i'm really happy with it there's no cons to this i had zero problems putting this together uh, I'm just really happy with it.